I'm a 2020 fashion marketing and communication graduate and since graduating in 2020 I actually went on to do a master's so within that year of study I kind of concentrated on an area I felt important to me and like my development before going into industry and stuff so I kind of concentrated on like digital and going into digital spaces and creating online opportunities for postgrad students and stuff like that and I think it's really helped me develop myself, my understanding, my research, especially coming into this role now, which I'm a digital fashion lecturer within fashion marketing and communication as well as working on stuff for the new course. I think you definitely have to be forward thinking. I think you have to kind of have a creative mindset as well. It kind of helps, especially within the kind of industry we're going into, you kind of have to be resourceful about everything around you, take everything in because it sounds so cliche. Everything's like connected in what we do, everything, especially being in a like digital sort of environment, you have to kind of be connected with everything and be in touch with everything around you and what you're researching, what you're looking at. So I think it's just having that drive to want to kind of be successful as well, especially within sort of creative settings. I think the new course caters for the industry is because it is in an industry-led course. It's driven by students, past students and the future to kind of all be again in this bubble of the fashion industry, the communication, the marketing and it all influences each other like we all influence each other even so I think coming from that perspective of kind of thinking within an industry setting definitely sets you up for going into industry and just kind of puts you on that path of how to think about things when you go into your jobs and stuff the work we create now is really well now when we were on the course we're really sort of industry-led projects and again when it comes to working for industry whether it be freelance whether you work for a company it all kind of makes sense and again you're not kind of intimidated by the work you're not kind of put off by deadlines and stuff like that or kind of time scales because you're already used to it you've been doing it for what two three years so it just kind of drives you to kind of keep going and even like challenging yourself every year and kind of creating more exciting stuff more diverse things more sort of again just pushing yourself and then I think industry really like that as well because you come into these jobs kind of knowing what you're doing whereas maybe some courses kind of don't give you that I feel like you're really supported my advice would be to go for it I think Obviously this course, it can be challenging. You can have quite challenging sort of tasks and things to do, but everything is so rewarding when you try and you kind of go for it in terms of what you create, what skills you learn, what things you can do, whether it be kind of creative and digital or marketing, and even like from different aspects like journalism, marketing, communication, everything like that. I think you just get so much on the course given to you in terms of what you can use, what you could do with the tasks and what you could like apply to industry. That is just important to kind of go for it and yeah, make the most of the time you have in university because it does go so quickly and then you're kind of pushed into kind of the more industry settings. Whereas this course kind of puts you in the industry setting first and then yeah, it lets you kind of create some amazing stuff and some amazing concepts that you can use again within portfolios and apply to like working life and jobs and stuff like that. <laughs>